Okay guys, so today I'm doing an unboxing video on the G Pro Wireless Ghost or the Logitech mouse. Um, let me show you guys the black version of it first because this is the white version of the G Pro that I'm just unboxing. It's pretty much the same, I think, exact box. I haven't I haven't looked at an actual unboxing on this. I've just seen it online. I've seen how it looks. I'm very excited to unbox it. It was a limited, di uh, limited, time, limited time drop um, that Logitech released. I don't remember exactly when, but I remember I was at school and I saw it drop and I was like, I just had to buy it right away. I legit pulled out my PayPal and I don't know, I, I went all out impulsive on it because I did miss the pink drop, the uh, pixel drop or something. So I had to like, okay, I love the G Pro, but I gotta buy the white one because it looks beautiful and all pro profits or proceeds of this mouse, like the, like, cause you can only really buy it online unless you find a retailer that's like selling it. So you can only really buy it on that time and all proceeds go to some type of charity for like um helping like i don't i don't i don't want to get this wrong i'm not sure what it is but i think it's something like um it helps out like uh figure out things for disabled people like disabled children that want to play video games and help them uh like create like types of systems and types of um i don't know i don't know exactly but just to help like um children that are disabled to be able to play video games or something I could be wrong, but I think that's what it is. I'm not sure. I that's that's just from my re, like me and my recall and my memory. I'm not sure, but anyways, I just want to get into the unboxing, guys. Uh, let's just jump right into it. Um, I gotta be careful here. Okay, so I gotta just do this. Oh, I think we're good here. Um, this this hurts me a little because I was really planning to save this and not do an unboxing video on it because I, I just wanted to keep the box with the packaging on and save it but I decided you know what it's, it doesn't hurt to do an unboxing video on it and just just you know just just use it for a little bit and if I don't want to use it right now then I, I won't use it I won't really use it because right now I still love my final mouse ultralight uh, 2 Cape Town it's such a good it's it's a great mouse this mouse is really great I'm using the foam on it for some reason <laughs> I don't know why, but it looks a little ugly, but it, it helps me aim better, so it works out. Okay. Let's just do this real quick. Oh, this is kind of hard to pull off. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's beautiful. Wow, that is beautiful. Oh, my God. It's the same, pretty much the same exact thing, I'm guessing. Here, let me put like let me turn on my light for you guys here. Oh, that looks way better. Okay. So, wow. I don't even want to touch it. I don't even want to touch it. I'm not gonna lie. I don't even want to touch it. Oh, it's beautiful. I don't know why I'm handling it with such care. <laughs> it's it's amazing. Wow, it's actually beautiful. Like, I love the black one how it is, but like, wow. Okay, that's great. That's actually really nice. Dude, look at that. That is actually really pretty. I have I have hyperglides on these, so I'm if I'm definitely if I end up actually using these, I will definitely install hyperglides because hyperglides are so nice with the G Pro. Trust me, it's just beautiful. Okay, so let's just take this out. Oh, and then you got, I want to see if the cable is white, because that actually, so I'm guessing these are all white too, so it's just going to go flash white, but I want to see, actually wait, yeah, I want to see the dongle, the dongle is very, 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 oh no, it's just regular, okay, so the dongle is pretty much the same as the old G Pro, because I have the dongle right here, so I gotta, I gotta label them white and black, because I'm not sure, I'm I got it now. I now I got him confused. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really know which one's which now. <laughs> um, yeah, I just got them confused. But I think they're the same. I'll tell you this: they're definitely the same. So they're pretty much the exact same. They did not change the color, which I'm a little bit confused why they didn't. But whatever, it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna have to test it out, <laughs> so I know which one's which. I don't think it's this one. Is it this one? 
Okay, this is this one. So this one. So definitely this one is for this one. Okay, we're good. We're good. I'm going to put this back inside because I don't want to use it yet. So let's put this back. These are the attachments for it. Actually, let me take this out. These are the, the side buttons for it. Like you could take these off. I don't want to take them off right now. But you can take them off and like switch them for these ones inside. Okay, they're all white, so it makes sense. And the other one comes with this. It's like right here. You got like extra like side buttons and, and stuff. Um, I think then this next box should be the cable. Yeah, it's the cable with the charging thingy. It's a weird mechanism what they use for that. It's really nice though. Uh, it's also black. I thought they were gonna make it white, but I mean, I'm all good with it. I don't. It's not that I care like heavily, but it would have been nicer if they made it white. But I guess it kind of like cool looks cool maybe with the. Yeah, let me see. I guess it looks kind of cool with the mouse wheel being black and stuff, but could have been nicer being white. It's all good though. Still looks really nice, and honestly, if you can get a G Pro and like you want to really upgrade your mouse from like a not a very good one, the G Pro wireless is definitely a way to go if you want to stick to with wireless. Um, it definitely is outdated with all the RGB stuff, but if you're not an RGB fan and you really care about your aim and stuff, this is probably the best mouse you can get for your, you know. I mean, it is a little expensive. I'm not gonna lie. It's like. Two hundred dollars. That's like Canadian. It's probably like one seventy US somewhere there. So it is a little expensive, but it's not bad, you know. So actually, I forgot to put this in the box, but I don't know how to really do a review on it because I just pretty much just unboxed it. But my past, like, this is how I feel about the G Pro. I'll, I'll be honest with you, it's a great mouse for me personally. I I play with the Ultralight Phantom more with video games that are like more aim oriented for me like counter strike and other games that i play with actual aim that i really need when i play like fortnite or something that has like the building mechanism for me like the building on this like it just i don't know why but when i build on fortnite with this mouse it just feels way better but yeah i don't know i might stick to the ultralight phantom phantom ultralight um cape town right now for i don't know how long but We'll see, man. I got three beautiful mouse here, mice here. I don't know, and um, I will definitely be, I will, I will definitely be trying this out in the future. I just don't know if I'm gonna try it out now. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for sticking into this unboxing. I will definitely, if I do use it, I will definitely make a review exactly on the this G Pro Ghost. But from my past, you know, um with the g pro the regular uh, g pro it is a great mouse um i highly recommend buying it uh, if you have the money because it is really expensive but yeah thank you guys so much for watching drop a like on the video it really i really really would appreciate it uh subscribe to my channel and see my future content that i'll be making so yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you all in my next video see you guys